Hello guys, we are back with our next lecture. In this lecture, let us go through the next question. Okay, so the question is gate CSE. Okay, so gate CSE 2007 question 40. So consider a hashing table. Okay, of size 7. Okay, so now they are giving some different size. So 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7. Okay, so 7 will not be there, right? So because it's a reminder game. Okay, yes. Okay, yes. So with the starting from index 0 and the hash function is 3x plus 4 mod 7. Okay. Yes. Assuming uh, assuming that the hash table is initially empty. Okay. So which of the following is the uh, is the content of the table when we insert 1, 3, 8 and 10 in the insertion order given above. Okay. So dash indicates that the slot is empty. So here they gave in terms of rows guys. Okay. Yes. So let us start. So the first option is a 1. So what is a 1 guys? So if you substitute 1 here. So 3 into 1 will be 3. So 3 plus 1 will be 4. Sorry 3 plus 4 will be 7. So 7 mod 7. So it will be 0. Right. So at this position 1 will be coming. So which options are eliminated? So option A is eliminated completely. Right. Yes. So now let us go through second value. So now insertion of 3 is at 1 is done. So let us go to 3. So 3 3 is 9. 9 plus 4 mod 7. So what is the value of 9 plus 4 guys? Okay. So the value of 9 plus 4 is nothing but 13. Right. So 13 mod 7. Okay. So if you do 13 mod 7, you will get 6 as the result. So at the 6th location, at last, you will push the 3. Okay. Similarly, moving on to 3 is done. So all 3 options are having 3 at the end. Okay. So it is satisfied. So let us check for 8. So 3 into 8 plus 4. Okay. So you can just use a calc if you are getting confused for these kind of problems, guys. So how you can use a calculator, normal calculator in this is. So do 3 into 8 first. Okay, so we got 24 plus 4. Okay, so we got 28. So 28 mod 7. So a few of you might be saying that. So in this calci, we are not having mod. Then how we are going to do? So do divided by 7. Okay, so what we got exactly 4. Means exactly 4 means there is no reminder, right? So hence this mod value is equal to 0. Okay, yes. Okay, so now I think we got a clash, right? So did they inform about linear probing or any method? guys? I think they did not inform. Okay, so if they did not inform, so let us check the options. So in options, they are, have, they are having each and every element is having different slot. Hence, 8 will come here, guys. So linear probing at 0, it is not possible. So you will increment by 1. So the result is 1. At 1 location, you will place the 8. Got it? Yes. So now let us do for 10. So 10 into 3 is a 30. That is 34 mod 7, right? That is also 6. So again, 6 is also having a clash. So it is... A, it, does, it cannot take place at 6. So if we add plus 1, that will become 7. But 7 is nothing but 0, right? Yes. So at 0 also we are having clash. At 1 also we are having the clash. At 2 we are not having the clash. So 10 will get, take place there. So now if you observe, so what will be the answer, guys? So B will be the answer, right? Yes. So using linear probing, we have done it. Okay, so they mentioned it. Sorry, that's my bad. So closed hashing, they told to use. So in closed hashing, what is the popular algorithm, guys? That is nothing but linear hashing, right? Yes. So, sorry, linear probing, right? Yes. So I hope everyone got a clear idea, right? So how B is the answer? Okay. So in the next lecture, let us continue with the next problem. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Like, share and subscribe for more awesome videos like this. Thank you.